Hello Internet, it's Thursday, January 6th. It's Old Christmas Day. Happy Old Christmas Day. Okay, so since I got back to St. John's, um, it's been really fun, but also really busy, and I'm really tired. And um, this morning, I woke up at 8, and I looked at the clock, and I considered the fact that I still didn't know where my camera was because I hadn't unpacked it yet, and I kind of went, eh. So I went back to sleep until I had to eat lunch and go to work at St. Joseph's. And then I got home, and I ate food, and then I went to a white elephant party. If you've never been to a white elephant party, they're probably the best thing in the world because you take all of these gifts that um, you don't want anymore, things that are cluttering up your house, things that stick out like a sore thumb or even like a white elephant, and you, uh, you wrap them up and then you put them under the tree when you get there and then uh, it, it, through the jigs and the reels somebody else winds up with your present. I had a water bottle holder which is this magnificent device where you um, you put a water bottle in this zippered contraption and then you it has like a strap that goes around your waist and it clips on and so when you're running your water bottle is accessible but it's still like down here and you I can't I, I got that, I won that at a ski patrol function. So I also forgot uh, around Christmas time that sometimes teachers get presents and also sort of forgot that I'm a teacher. And so some of my students' parents got me presents. Um, and that's really awesome. I got uh, a lunchbox, um, like a neoprene flexible lunchbox, which I vow to use someday. Hopefully the fact that I now own a lunchbox will help me to bring lunches places so that I don't keep buying lunches all the time. Shortbread cookies, which were a very sweet idea, and the person who gave them to me had no idea that I had food allergies, um, but my coworker really appreciated them. And I got a Tim Hortons gift card, which is always appreciated. And um, I got this ornament, which is actually really pretty. Um, it's gold and it has like green jewels and it's a butterfly. It's on a really pretty ribbon, but um, we don't have a tree. Like I actually don't have anywhere to put tree ornaments. We have plenty of places. This place is all decked out for Christmas. Um, I'll see if I can show you uh, a little bit later, but like we have a bunch of ornaments, but we don't have anywhere to put tree ornaments because we have no tree. Um, I put that very thoughtful gift into my, um, my gift bag with the uh, water bottle holder and pawned it off. And in return, I got this thing. It's so good. Hang on now, I'll show you. Okay, this is a magnetic Kama Sutra, a naughty sculpture kit. That's it, a naughty sculpture kit. It comes with your naughty little guide. Um, which is sort of like a short, extremely abridged version of the Kama Sutra um, with both location tips and um, little hints. Uh, and it comes with this, well this is I guess the main event, it doesn't really come with it, this magnetic sculpture which is composed of 69 little silver and gold women and men who you can stick to each other in suggestive ways. Um, they're in various flexible positions. This one's my favorite. This person is doing a high jump. High jumping. That's my phone receiving an email. Um, I'm going to put this away now. But uh, that was my week after Christmas, and I might just play with this for a really long time because it's fascinating and shiny.